All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Tabletop Simulator Victory at Sea, the Battle of Midway. It's the Midway Atoll. Here we have the composition of the American fleet. We have the Imperial Japanese Navy set up. We've got four carriers, two battleships. Two heavy cruisers and a light cruiser in attendance in the main force, accompanied by 12 destroyers. We've got four heavy cruisers, one of which is backwards for some reason. Four heavy cruisers in the reserve squadron, flanked by two Fubuki class destroyers. I have. Uh, what's it? 48 aircraft in total. Uh, obviously not representative of what was current in the battle. Uh, the United States Navy has three car uh, fleet carrier aircraft, uh, 16 destroyers. Uh, oh, actually, is it how many? How many destroyers you got? Uh, 15. 15 destroyers, 16 submarines, uh, an array of aircraft. Uh, in accordance with their Yorktown carrier instructions. Uh, this is going to be interesting. Uh, the objective is to slog at each other to one of us surrenders or retreats, um, and so on and so forth. Uh, these are my custom uh, markers that I've made here. These are the rule books. I've broken down the rule book into specific sections for ease of usage. I also have the PDF as well, which I will be using as well. Uh, each I've given each faction broken up each faction's rule books so you'll see here that the United States Navy has its own rule book the Japanese Imperial Japanese Navy has its own rule book uh, we've broken that up into sections uh, this battle today the United States Navy will be commanded by my friend Luke and my other friend Nick um, and they will be commanding the United States Navy and myself I will be in command of the Imperial Japanese Navy and their strike force on Midway all right now a uh, bit of house rules we have given the United States the automatic initiative to begin proceedings uh, noting that Midway at the Battle of Midway the United States had broken the codes on the Japanese and knew they were coming so, uh, to reflect that, we're going to give the United States the head start in this battle. So, Luke, if you are ready, kick us off. It doesn't look like they're ready, but... Uh, also, we've... Um, you can see here we've put squadron pennants on the front of each of the squadrons we intend to move as a squadron, which will make it nice and easy for us to uh, navigate around. We've got he's got a couple of squadrons here, There's a couple of ships moving in twos, a couple of squadrons moving in lines here. Submarines acting independently by the looks of it, and a group of destroyers and cruisers behind escorting their carriers and yeah let's get going so all right just having a read over the rules real quick uh-huh okay I think we're using the at all cost scenario as well. Um, not that that really has any bearing over proceedings. Submarine has. So submersed, it can only go two inches. Mm -hmm. right. Okay. 
Uh, I moved one. Uh, move, I'm gonna move. What, yeah, move the squadrons together. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna move eight total ships, four squadrons, just straight up. You can go ahead and do eight total ships on your side. Ah, uh, that's not gonna be possible, Chief. I tell you what, move all your ships, and then I'll move all my ships. Or we'll go one for one, one squadron each. Yeah. Okay. Move this. Yes, you can open whatever you want, Nick. Oh, that's not working. Well, how embarrassing. There we go. We're going to move. Seven inches. Uh, I'm going to roll. Okay, not for this squadron. Should probably move. Should probably put dice in here, that which I forgot again. I continually forget that. Like dice for me. Seven. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to perform a special actions uh, on my uh, what are these uh, Kagero class destroyers. I'm going to go for uh, flank speed. Actually, I don't have to do a command check, which is good. I just automatically pass it, but it gives me 50% speed at a cost of one attack die. I am happy to accept. Seven plus three and a half gives me ten and a half. These bad boys are boosting. Six inches for the carrier task group. Okay, I have moved all of my ships. Um, so this cover sheet can stay at the back. I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to aircraft, start launching planes. 25 inches. Uh, I have uh, moved all of my ships. Roger. I've started launching aircraft is to launch an aircraft that's it's considered uh, a, like it is a, its own it's to be done in the movement phase and it is its own movement okay but only one per aircraft carrier yeah ah uh, yes so if you watch like how i'm doing it now positioning a flight of 
aircraft in front of each carrier and then they will move the appropriate speed from that position. Okay. Like that. <sighs> yes, Lee. Okay, 25 inches. Come on, bro, you should be doing this stuff, man. zeros in the air. Uh, I'm going to launch spotter aircraft from the Megami. Spotter aircraft. Uh, did they move seven inches I think if I was correct? I thought it was twelve. Is it twelve? Yeah it was twelve last time wasn't it? No it is seven. Seven inches. The lead Megami. Is that for all spotters? Uh, yeah, that is correct. Seven inches from that one. Uh, I'm going to launch. Launch one from my Nagato as well. So remember as well, they're not uh, compounding, or com is that com the correct word? They don't compound on top of each other. You know what I mean? So like, I don't get extra bonuses because I've got extra spotter aircraft up. Yeah, it's just the one. Yeah, it's just the one. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's my move. It's my movement phase. Uh, the range on the Nagato is... I mean, I doubt I'll be in range of anything, but... You never know. Yamato's got some stupid range. Congo. There he is. The Nagato range is 43 inches. Let's have a look. Shall we? Well, that's about 100 easy. Between us. 43 inches doesn't even get me to the cure at all. Cool. Okay. I'm the doctor. So that's the end of phase one. That's um, slight, slight not yet. Let, let Nick get. Oh, is he not? Is he not moved his formations? I've moved. I've moved his ships. So I haven't. I've put a spotter out, but I haven't done his other aircraft. Okay, let me do. It. Fucking hell, he keeps saying Goku wants to open up URL. Spotify, I don't know. Just press cancel. I've cancelled it, it keeps coming up. It's so fucking hard. Well, change, um, you change it on the iPad. What, what do I do on the iPad to stop this? Same chapter wants to. Use it like an iPad. Click on the URL, type something. Tidy this shit up. It looks gay. Yeah. Okay, they're All flying right. in formation. So we've moved ships, that's it. And launched aircraft. One squadron of aircraft per carrier. And we can launch one from the base, right? Yes, correct. I thought we could launch all the aircraft. No, 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 no. One per. Is it one for one or what's the search? One per carrier per turn. And one per runway. Yep. Oh shit, I'm gonna double up what I've got there. Ah, <sighs> fuck. Anyway, I'll do it, I'll do it after. Alright. I'm gonna launch, uh. <laughs> That's a Dauntless as well. Where's your Devastators? Oh, there. So, 
I'll launch a, do a Dauntless and a Devastator from each carrier. Um, so this is the larger map as well, so you won't get as far as you did on the game we played, Nick. Yeah. Okay. Like I launched from my aircraft, and you can see where my zeros are in formation. That's 25 inches from my carrier. Okay. Did not get very far. Okay, I can get 19 inches, so... Right I'll just put that spotter in front. Yep. The spotter can only move seven inches. Don't forget. Oh, okay. And the devastator can move how long? It is fifteen. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's pretty small. Hmm. Now you know why I was kick you were kicking my ass last time. <laughs> yeah, it was a bit OP, but mm. it didn't learn the Wildcats can take a few hits, you know. No, the Hellcats. Hellcats. Hellcats, yeah. Okay, so I launched one squadron from each aircraft carrier. Yep. And then one cool. from the airfield. Oh, yeah. Look, if you knew, um, what's your plan here? Um, just kind of go around to the right side. Just go around to the right side. Good plan. Solid. Hmm. I don't want to complicate it too much, you know, just fucking <laughs> get on the outside. No, hey, hey, I like it. Why make it difficult? Alright, launched. And that has scaled down. Let me know when his movement turn has completed. Yeah, all good. Yeah. I just rolled a 9 for initiative. Ah, excellent, I forgot about that. Good. Uh, 2d6. I rolled a six, you have the initiative. Oh. I'm changing the music because this is not very Japanese at all. Yeah, the Shogun Total War soundtrack. What about Japanese war songs? I don't know. We're really about it, eh? Let's see, let's see what they got here. They got some stuff, but they weren't really all about it. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't think they have Okay, have you done your first movements? I'm doing them now. Kaguru desu ne. Shit. I actually misplaced this squadron here. Have you moved your first squadron? Yeah, man, I'm just moving. How many have you moved? Almost, uh, four of my subs. Squadrons. We're not, we're not close, so we don't need to 
worry too much about it just yet. Have you seen the movie Empire of the Sun, Tom? Uh, no, I can't say I have. It's got a, a young Christian Bale. You should watch it. It's, it's all about um, World War Two and prison camps and. But it's more like um, to do with the invasion and takeover of uh, Hong Kong. Mm. And then the Brits who are taken into prisoner, into captivity. Alright, I moved everything in my. Interesting uh, move how they move so late. Yeah, just fucking crab walk through the wall. Well, I'm, I'm trying to. I've moved three and a half inches and I'm trying to move the other three and a half inches. Alright? So, so advanced the Japanese in World War II. Oh, no wonder. No wonder they fucking dominated. Well, joke's on you, I'm not even fucking done, so. Relax. Relax, guy. <laughs> There's more. You're only, allowed one, you're only allowed one uh, rotation in a movement. Yeah, this is it. I moved three. Yeah. I moved three and a half inches. I haven't finished my move yet, you son of a bitch. What are you moving, son bitch? You I'm moving. Are. So this squadron. Let me let me draw it out for you. This squadron is going like this. Wait. So I've already moved here. Okay. Is, uh, okay, now so they're now they're making he, the turn. He's just doing it so they're all in a yeah, nice that, yes. the degree is too far. That's too far of a degree change. What? Yeah. They, I moved them three and a half inches, which is half. Their speed is seven. Yeah, yeah, but you can't spin them more than once. Like you can't, you can't do this and then do that. It's it's just the one one. No, spin. it's not. It's two ticks. As many ticks. As, so each tick counts as an inch. So now I'm gonna do. So I've moved three and a half and two inches, which gives me five and a half out of seven, which means I have one and a half inches to move from this position right here. So hang on, hang on. All right. So Tom, mm -hmm. for instance. What I do right now, I'll just get this guy here, right? and then I oh. I rotate him. That's one tick, is it? Yeah, that's what, and that counts as one inch. Ah, oh, to your turning score, so you can have two rotated. Yeah. Okay. All right. Never mind. And that's just one. that's one and a half inches right there. See oh, that? Okay. I really didn't move much at all, but I turned. Um. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not. Concerned about the distance moved. I'm concerned. I was wondering about the the rotationals. No, I'm also going to move this fleet seven inches. Ah, oh, can I have the pennant as well, please? Thank you, game. Wow, look at that beautiful formation flying straight up the uh, up the guts. The line of the ships there. They're all saluting. They're all bowing. Hey! They're all saluting. Do us proud. Do us proud, the honorable warriors. If you saw this Empire of the Sun movie, I'd probably, and that I would probably, there, I would probably juice my pants. You, you, you'd enjoy it because you'd see that moment and you'd be like, oh, okay, beautiful. aircraft time. Honor that Aircraft time. Yep. Let's so, go. So, hang, hang on. Have I moved all my ships? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Have you? You're the admiral. You I tell don't... me. Look, did you move my ships when I, was I didn't touch you? I didn't touch your ships. I, I moved them for the first movement phase, and then you came back in the second. Oh, so I haven't moved in this phase. No. Okay. Can I move mine? No. Of course you can. All right. What I want to do? Why are you asking for permission? You are an admiral, also. No, I'm. I'm just wondering what's happening here. That's all. How ah, these stupid so... Americans argue among themselves. How far can those subs move, Luke? Uh, four inches unsubmersed, two inches submersed. And now they 
uh, how do we submerse? How do we? Uh, I think you just do it as part of your movement phase, and that's it. Right, so it doesn't actually take any of your movement points. No. Okay, so my Not subs are away. submersed. So two inches, is that right? Yep. Wow. It's literally there. Yeah, you're not going anywhere very quickly. But I do know destroyers are seven inches, aren't they? So this is the way to do it, bro. Pick it up. Yep. Hold tab. Yeah. So that's seven inches there. Lame. This full in the formation, this. Aircraft are launched. Seven inches. Seven inches. Are you sure the spot is only seven? It's a hundred percent correct. That's surprising because every other fucking plane is at least. It says uh, observation 20. aircraft seven. No, it's right. He's right there. You also have no, no guns as well. So not it. He's right. That is all my ships moved, all my aircraft launched. Yeah. Still no range. I, I don't know. Okay. You've launched all your aircraft. Mm -hmm. Or like that I can launch in this turn. Ah, okay. I apologize so, for the hiccups. Can I launch another quadrant as well? You can launch another three planes, two, one from each carrier and one from the ground. And the this ones that are moved before, I can move them again. Yes, you can. Yep, correct. Yep, yeah, yeah, beautiful. All right, Luke, Hellcats, how come, can you just get read out for me? How far? Uh, Hellcat is... 27. 27. Oh, big boy uh, moves here. Big boy moves. It's further than my zeros, though, I think. Keep them out in front. Look at those zeros incoming. I can't wait for the impending dogfight. It's going to be huge. Right, I don't... We need your fighters up near my squadrons. I don't know if you can tell, but all I've launched so far is fucking fighters. I've got all my zeros uh, in the air. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I might launch a couple more fighters. I mean, <laughs> I haven't launched all my fighters. <laughs> <laughs> uh, launching fighter. Oh, oh, it's 25 inches, gang. Damn. I've been shortchanging myself. Fine. What I can do is I'll grab the formation. Launching fighter. Three extra inches. I will always do that stuff. Okay, guys, also, don't forget your special traits as well. Um, so like I know, your, I forgot that last time. Your command stuff. Okay, so, for example, so special actions. I have one of my, uh, one of my groups, one of my squadrons is on flank speed. So this one here. Notice how he's further forward than this squadron here. That's because this... That's because the squadron on the left is moving at 10 inches and the squadron on the right is moving at 7. Okay. 
What you talking about, Bruce? I mean, I just told you. Alright, yeah, cool, man. All good. It's my special actions. So I've done a special actions. In order to get my... My butt moving. Make sure you scale down the size of those planes, alright? <laughs> he did it to me before, he's trying to intimidate me. He said it before, I said, I said, what the fuck are you doing, bro? You fucking, you, your shits are huge. So part of my, it's a propaganda thing. He's trying to intimidate me. Little do we know that these are samurai and they will not be intimidated. Probably going to get cancelled now for racism. But, you know, yeah. whatever. It was a good run. I've already reported you. <laughs> Alright, so we've all done our second phase movement. Yep, so that's second movement phase done. Uh, nobody is in range of shooting. Let's just do a quick check for that. Nope. I am no. now only just shooting past the Cure Atoll. What is it? Is it a Yamamoto? No, it's a Nagato. Where's the Yamamoto? I don't have one. Uh... The Yamato was not present in this battle. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. It's later war. Okay, cool. Alright, fucking... uh, just everyone move again. No need to do initiative. Nope. Okay. Now, before you get all butt hurt, I'm gonna initiate a turn here. Okay. So, five. Maybe just right here. I'm gonna mark it. It's a lot more difficult to move squadrons in time, fucking... Okay, there I am in the turn. Alright. So I've moved five inches, I've turned two, which gives me a remaining three. Which puts me right here. At flank speed. So remember, we're moving ships first, then aircraft. Seven inches. And I, I guess we we consider everything like if you move your ship through another of your ships, you're going to crash that ship. So. Uh, no, so. it's no. The game specifically says that um, it's assumed Allowed. that the ship will move out of the way, will maneuver right. to avoid the other one. Ah, okay, so I can move through ships. Yep. So we're saying. And I'm going to put... No, I'm not, actually. I'm not. I was going to go flank speed, but I'm not going to. There we go. Uh, that is all my ships moved. Racing... Racing movements as I go. Also, if you're wondering about the stability of my internet right now, I moved my router. Ooh. He's now in the same room as me. Lucky boy. Mm. So what have we got moving here? Destroyers. Interesting. What should I do here? Have a look. What have we got? We've got Kagero's here, right? Hagoro. Hmm. Let me 
know when you're ready to move aircraft. Yeah. Yeah, I should be ready now. Alright, ready to launch. Okay, stand by. Stand by. Launching aircraft. Twenty-five inches. Okay. My rearmost finest squadron is going to form the front of this squadron of aircraft. 25. We're going to form up in formation around him. I've got my fighters surrounding my two bombers. Now it's time to bring out the few more bombers I need. Oh, hang on. What's the Devastator? The Devastator... I wonder, if, is there a flank speed for aircraft, I wonder? Do you want to just take control of all aircraft and aircraft carrier? Me? Yeah. What do you mean? What are we talking about? Just take control of my aircraft and aircraft carrier, except for my spotter. Okay, yeah, because yours seemed a bit all over the place. Have you moved your Dauntlesses, go? Yeah. Both Dauntlesses? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so what can I move now? Nothing. Okay, <laughs> alright. But yeah, if you want me to take over, I'll take over the aircraft as well. Yeah. That way you can coordinate the attacks you want. Well, basically, I want to take out the zeros first. So I need six Hellcats to four zeros. Alright, we're all done. Uh, sorry, yep. I have one more move. That would be this spotter aircraft. Are oh, you? Yeah, because you got four aircraft, in this, no, aircraft carriers in this battle. Yep, I got one more than you, yeah. But you have the land, but the land based aircraft. Yeah. Okay, that's all aircraft moved. Uh, I. Just to check that we're not in range of any shooting. Still no, only just shooting way past off. the crew. Way off. Actually, did I move this fleet? This one here? Yeah, I did, right? I did. I did. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Movement phase three. Let us begin. I'm just going to save myself a bit of time here. And whoa, just whoa, whoa. Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Those, those are individual ships, my compadre. Can I just move them like that? No, because some of them are not facing the same direction. Okay, uh, for your information, this fleet here is no longer in flank speed. I am now moving regular speed. Therefore, I do not suffer the attack penalty anymore. <laughs> I 
<laughs> okay. Now I've got to ask you, gentlemen. How much of dicks are you going to be? Are you going to make me take the one tick move to avoid this island, or can I cut the corner? <laughs> nah, you run aground, my man. <laughs> you motherfucker. You motherfucker, <laughs> run aground. Alright, fine, fuck yeah. Three and a half. Gets me right there. Okay. I'm going to rotate one. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Literally made the whole fucking squadron. Uh, <laughs> you son of a bitch. Right. This, this is a goddamn war game. We're not here to fuck around. And you were there. You're on top of this here, destroyer. Okay, and then he. <laughs> I can't believe you did that to me. Oh. Uh, I'm just gonna move my zeros because they're in the way. Oh, sit down, destroy you, son of a bitch. There's no point moving my aircraft carriers, to be honest. just hit like an absolute hectic bit as I've got my I'm launching the last of my zeros <laughs> this is where the battle lives or dies on this motherfucker right here we are readying ourselves for the victory the fate the Empire of Japan rests upon these Zero Squadrons. Ooh. Ooh. We have ourselves a battle brewing. Dog oh, yeah. The dogfights are inbound. Ooh it's about to begin, boys. The fight begins. Jesus, how many? How did you get so many aircraft? Such a close formation. They're, Don't forget what these they're aircraft. Wild, they're wildcats, mate. They, yeah, but they're wildcats. But you have three aircraft carriers. I'm confused how this happened. This is over. Me. This is over three turns, remember? So yeah, but look at a... look at mine though. Look, so I have. This was my first turn. This is my second turn. This is my third yeah. turn. And yeah, then look, this look is this. this is the third turn launch. Look at the inches there. They can it's... do twenty seven inches and they'll just do their third one. Okay. But I don't understand how they're grouped up like that. Like there should be three can... there should be four max. Yeah, but they they can like you can do a circle of twenty seven inches and Yeah. Like, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you okay. just... Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm happy. 